advice that you have for everyone. Veronica, you're actually dating. During the latest, the single life tell-all between Debbie Aguero and the Mean Girls, as she termed it, the 90-day flans claws were out. Lately, that intensity manifested itself in remarks on social media when Debbie took aim at Veronica Rodriguez. So what's the most recent? At the most recent, the single life tell-all, there was a Debbie showdown. Debbie Johnson filed divorce papers to Natalie Mordotseva, who was shocked by Mike Youngquist's gesture. But Debbie Aguero was not happy with Mama Debbie's handling of that particular circumstance. Debbie Johnson served Mike's divorce papers to Natalie, which Debbie Aguero perceived as a dubious act. As a result, the Debbies started to act aggressively, throwing obscenities and flinging mud at one another. Fans of 90 Day Fiance are accustomed to people touching one other at the tell-all. That was a whole different story though, when you saw the two Debbies fighting with each other. This is the perfect place for insults to fly, the tell-all. But between Debbie Aguero and Debbie Johnson, things took a turn for the worst, with Veronica Rodriguez even getting involved. Debbie Johnson offered to serve Natalie with divorce papers, but Debbie Aguero objected. All at once, this one move brought up a new can of worms and kicked the hornet's nest. With one insult following another, the two Debbies went for each other. Fans of 90 Day Fiance excitedly snatched up popcorn as the insults came flying. Despite the fact that both of the women are older, there was much discussion about everything from Debbie Johnson being a Judas to Debbie Aguero pursuing a younger Osama. At the tell-all, this is just the kind of drama that viewers aspire for. To be fair though, nobody anticipated the two Debbies to become involved in it to the extent that they did. Fans of 90 Day Fiance adore Debbie Aguero. She demonstrated at the tell-all that she isn't scared to defend herself, even in the face of multiple cast members joining forces against her. According to Debbie, there's a much darker plot underway, with Veronica Rodriguez at the center. Debbie Aguero is one of those people who follows her own rhythm. She recently continued to poke fun at Veronica Rodriguez after what happened to her during the tell-all incident. Veronica Rodriguez, according to Debbie Aguero, intimidates the other cast members by effectively identifying herself as the head of their clique. Debbie claims she even said, Veronica made sure I wasn't invited to the tell all after party because I was the only one who got really physical with her. Despite her status as the clique club president, she seems to frighten everyone. The fact that 90 Day Fiance fans are leaving the show, many of them are no longer on Team Veronica, makes this even more intriguing. The manner Veronica pursued Debbie Aguero was viewed negatively by many viewers. Furthermore, Veronica appears to be the leader of the 90 Day Fiance group that Debbie has been involved in, given all the tea that Debbie has recently poured on her. Many fans of 90 Day Fiance claimed that throughout her plotline in the single life with Jamal Menzies, Veronica began to reveal her true self. Adding this to the way that Debbie Aguero was surrounded and cornered by Veronica and the others at the tell all in all, this is more than sufficient to portray Veronica as the antagonist of the franchise, and many people are starting to see this.